Hey guys, what's up? It's Kelvin here. So, I am back again with a hair tutorial today. I know I promised you guys in my last video that I'll do a hair tutorial for this hairstyle right here. And guess what? I did it. <laughs> it's definitely not like a four month wait this time. So, I guess that's a good thing. Um, but anyways, yeah, I did this hair tutorial for you guys. I've had this hairstyle for a little a little while now. My hair color for originally for this hairstyle was actually a lot ashier. Um, the thing is the ash color actually kind of like washed out a bit so now it's more blonde. But um, anyways the style didn't really change. It's a really fun style to do. Uh, what's good about this is that not only can you just do do it like an updo like this, you can also like wear a hat with it and it'll still look really nice. A uh, warning though, this does take kind of a long time. There are a lot of steps to do it, but the thing is it's actually really easy. None of the steps are like super super hard. You can't it's not foolproof, but like it's not really hard to do at the same time. You just need to commit the time. But then like the good side of that is this hairstyle usually for me at least lasts quite a while. Like I don't like to wash my hair every day as you guys already know. So I like to usually wash it every like two days or like maybe like two and a half. I'm just, I, it's kind of random. But um, and this usually lasts. I just have to fix it up a little bit in the morning and then it's all good. But yeah, if you guys like this hairstyle and you guys want to learn how to do this hairstyle, keep on watching. Okay, so I just washed my hair and then now I'm going to put in some leave-in conditioner. This product's really good for maintaining hair color. And then now I'm going to put in some KMS Hair Play Spray. This really helps with holding the style. And you spray that on actually when your hair is wet and then you blow dry it dry. Okay, and then now we're just going to blow dry uh, the hair. So when you first start out with blow drying your hair, blow dry forward and then blow dry upwards. And with your fingers, you can use this motion where you're kind of like scrunching up your hair because that way it really does give your hair a lot more texture and it works very well with the KMS uh, hairspray. And then with my, you know, special technique, we're going to use the round brush, but we're only going to use it for the back part of the hair and don't and leave the rest of the head. So just use it for the very back. Clip up the back and then now we're going to start using a straightener and we're actually going to heat style the rest of the hair to get that flick up motion. So with the straightener, just curl upwards and outwards. Do this layer by layer so then you really get like every piece and you don't want any of the pieces to be not in that texture and that shape. But yeah, it's actually pretty simple. Just make sure you go slow and don't burn yourself. Um, it does take a lot of practice, but then once you get the hang of it, it's actually the easiest thing. For easier access, I guess you can also clip up the parts that you already did, so then you really do get to get each piece. Okay, the bangs are very important. You have to make sure that it has a nice curl going outwards. It has a nice flick going up. Kind of how it looks like after uh, straightening and curling all of my hair. Uh, don't worry if it looks a little cray. Uh, we gonna fake that up. This is a little trick I learned. Get two hair clips and clip down the sides because for me, I don't know about you guys, but my sideburns always poof outwards. This way it really does help control it. Now with some clay, or in this case I'm using the DFI hair styling cream, we're going to start styling the hair. You really don't need that much, just a little dab, and then wipe it all over, or rub it all over your hands, and then we're gonna put it all over the hair. Just literally just get all the product in there as possible, as much as possible, and then we're going to style it afterward. So just keep pushing it upward so that it really does get that good hold. Try to focus the most of the wax in the roots of the hair so that it provides better hold. And then yeah, now uh, take out the clip so that you also get a little bit of product onto the sides and the back of the hair. And once you kind of get a nice shape, it really is just a matter of playing with it. Get, don't forget to use hairspray to kind of lock it in. 
What you can also do now is uh, put some hairspray on the side, so like the sideburns, and then you put back on the hair clip. And then what we're going to do is use the blow dryer and actually blow dry it. Um, this technique I learned at the hair salon, and it's actually really good for flattening down the sideburns. But be careful, uh, the clip and the hair gets really hot, so really try not to burn yourself. Don't try to overheat it, but then try to put the heat setting at like very high, but the speed at very low. And then yeah, when you take off the hair clips, the sideburns just magically falls down. It's beautiful. I really like it. But yeah, really don't burn yourself, please. And then I'm just going to add some shine spray to really get that nice shine that will make your hair glisten. And yeah, we're done. Here's a 360 of the hair. This hairstyle is really fun. It's really versatile. You can put it, you can wear a hat, you can go out clubbing with it. It can be formal, it's professional, it looks good. Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed that video. That's it from me today. I'm probably going to film another one because I'm actually going to get a haircut pretty soon. My hair's getting a, this getting a little too long. But um, yeah, I hope you guys have fun with this tutorial. Make sure you guys like, Instagram photos and show me like what you guys did with this so I can see like send me like YouTube links to like your your videos I just really want to see how you guys do with this and yeah uh, Make sure to write a lot of comments. I actually love reading your comments. You guys are so nice. Oh airplane Like, you guys are an amazing bunch of viewers and subscribers. I've really anticipated a lot more hate, but, like, you guys never seem to prove me wrong um, that I have, like, the best subscribers in the world. My last video, I literally read all the comments, and you guys are just like, oh, I'm so happy you're back. Like, oh my god, I was on my YouTube homepage, and then I saw your face, and I was like, no way. But, yeah, you guys are really cool, so I'm very glad that I have you guys. Um, and, yeah, have fun. And I'll see you guys soon. Good luck with this. And once again, this was Kelvin. Peace. Okay, guys, what's up? It's Kelvin here. Uh, it has been a very long time since I have seen you guys. How are you? Ow. Oh, I just got that on film.